It is an amazing feat to have dreams of going forward as a community than just alone. Beyond the purpose of being self-reliant, NH by Nurul Huda Islamic Boarding School aims to empower disadvantaged children and local community. Whether or not NH can achieve its main mission is determined by factors such as having a distinct value and being located at a lucrative rural tourism village. We used an alignment matrix to determine that NH Corp is the area with the most significant impact. We chose to focus on NH Coffee because it has a potential to tap extensive market of coffee powder and NH Mart because if developed, it will bring so much impact as a place where locals can sell their products. We noticed that there are also problems caused by manual processes and lack of work ethics. We recognize that there are three main problems that NH must solve. First, inability to engage local community in NH Mart. Second, limited customer base of NH Corp's products. And third, lack of structure and administration in business process. Hence, our proposed solution must meet the stated objective. This is how we arrive at our proposed solution. Here are our proposed solutions. Next. With 1.8 billion IDR investment on agrotourism, Langus size potential on tourism is very high, and NHA can leverage this opportunity. Even though tourism is very affected by COVID-19, we've already mitigated the current situation that will be explained later on in implementation. So how exactly will this partnership work? And how much and its value will then be included in Desa Langustari? agro-tourism packages and branding. With this solution, and how we'll be able to tap a bigger customer pool and empowering local community through local product demand increase. Next. To increase and how much attractiveness, we also add production journey information. This is how basically the QR code labeling on the mark will be implement implemented. After the customer scan the barcode, the customer will then be directed to how certain product is produced by the locals. With this, and how much will have an engaging new value and educational experience for the market. Next. The second solution is to act as a coffee shop supplier in Banyumas. We chose coffee because Enha Coffee already has a high number of sales and exposure. We believe that the value proposition of Enha Coffee, which is low prices, empowering Banyumas locals and altruistic value will attract the high number of operating coffee shop in Banyumas. So with the renewed business model channel, Enha will implement multi-channel distribution for Enha Coffee, enhance, hence adding new revenue stream. Next. The third solution is creating Microsoft Excel and VBA-based administration system. This system will be implemented in delivery, inventory, scheduling, procurement and sales, student sales in which a cashless system will be implemented and also standardization. So what exactly didn't we propose a fancy attack? Simply, NHA doesn't need those. NHA's current resources and capability towards internet and connection usage is inadequate and limited by external factors. Hence, we believe that our solution is easy to implement, innovative, suitable, eliminating manuality, and most importantly, reusable for further improvement. Next. This is the mock-up of a VBA and Excel-based administration system. The user will then just have to input several data fields and also gain a report such as data, information, and knowledge through a programmable interface, and then it will be stored on an Excel database. This solution will enable NHA to make a more strategic analysis, automation, and optimize decision-making to develop their business more and more. Next. We also propose organizational revamping to do more efficient decision-making bureaucracy. Next. And this is our solution prioritization. Next. To validate the solution, we classify and how much sectional market segment as two. One natural choice that will be the offline store visitors. The market is huge. By utilizing enhanced social media and tourism accounts such as Explore Indonesia to promote and explore Langong Sari and Enhamart's unique user experience, we can attract customers to consider Langong Sari and Enhamart as tourism destination. Next. Second, online buyers that have not been fully advertised, we can create product campaign videos and publicize it on Hat TV that has 6K subscribers providing link directing to the marketplace. Next. On visibility, we have considered the current COVID-19 pandemic and its impact on business. As it takes 16 months of preparation, we said that by the time our solutions are ready, the situations have improved. For finance, we offer profitable, reasonable budget. Next. The biggest risks come from value proposition delivery failure because of internet infrastructure, but we can tackle that by lobbying local government for infrastructure betterment. Next. Hence, by market expansion, increasing involvement with local community, and ensuring efficiency of business processes, and how is able to tackle its problems and go beyond in serving as local communities. Next.
If I miss up, for you are my solution, please scan. Thank you. You guys, oh, okay. Thank you. Like a scan. Okay, now we are going to start in the Q and A sessions with the judges. So, judges, you have any questions? You can start now. Thank you. Hi, I'm Mavis. Uh, thank you for the presentation, Bodru. Uh, can we bring the slides back to, um, I noticed that you actually chose um, Enha Coffee and Enha Mud as like a, um, two, two areas that you want to focus on. Um, is this the yeah. slide that you Yes, meant? that's right. Yes, that's right. Uh, can I just ask, because I understand that you use an alignment matrix for um, to find out which pillar that you want to focus. But for the NHA Corp, can I just know about like the thought process? Why would you choose, why do you all choose coffee and mud over the rest of the other pillars? Okay. <clears throat> so um, uh, let me answer uh, the question. Um, for choosing coffee and mud, um, we also um, weigh the impact and the significance of the products on, and business line in NHA Corps, which has various um, products. And we noticed that um, coffee and mud has the most potential. Why? Um, NHA coffee, because um, um, they are already um, like the main product of NHA Corp itself. As we can see on their um, website, um, their landing page um, has coffee in it. And also um, the industry for coffee in Indonesia is like currently um, very lucrative. So we believe that coffee will have a strong potential to grow. And um, why Enhamart? Um, because Enhamart um, is a place where locals can um, sell their products and with our solution um, to enhance the branding of um, local products, it will be a very um, significant, it will give a very significant impact for um, local empowerment also. Okay, sure. Thank you. Yeah. Uh, okay. Another question on like actually is on the VBA portion. So um, you mentioned you would actually choose VBA based administration system over uh, uh, ERP system, right? Um, can I just know um, maybe one, what is the main drive for actually um, choosing VBA system instead of ERP? What's the main issue with um, probably ERP? Okay, uh, to answer that question, uh, we actually over overlooking the, the current need, the current necessities of NHA itself. So they, they, they do not need the ERP for now because VBA will answer all that as VBA can, can, be, can be standardized throughout the business processes. Other than that, because of VBA, it doesn't uh, need much fees and also expenditure. Uh, and that is very relating to the NHA and how business processes and also incomes. Uh, to add for Jory's answer, actually, uh, what, uh, the, the main benefit of VBA is that it doesn't need internet connection, which is one of the external constraints that NHA is facing. And moreover, we say that when we want to implement certain technology, considering the, you know, the situation of the technology savviness of NHA Corp, we need to take baby steps in order to achieve not only infrastructure readiness, but also human resource readiness in you know, operating and implementing uh, the, the system that we want to use. That's why we consider to take you know, a less fancier tech, but is you know, feasible and more grounded to the characteristic of NHA. Yeah, but other than that, VBA is also very open to further improvement if the data were to be used in the ERP uh, for the further improvement, for instance. Right, very well thought of. Thank you. I think that's all from me. the judges we have five minutes left actually 
So uh, any questions would be greatly accepted. Yes. Okay, uh, this is Tony. Um, can I see uh, the previous slides, please? Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. Uh, so, uh, in here, you basically want to expand the partnership with cafes in Banyumas, yeah? So, uh, I would like to know, because uh, it's, it, it was... Uh, Wait, wait a second. Um, so how, how do you do this? Can you explain this? Anyone? Um, anyone? Okay. okay, so um, um, the idea is to um, supply this NH coffee beans and powder as um, ingredients for coffee in coffee shops. And mm -hmm. Um, we do that so that um, NH can have a larger customer base than um, what it has now. And why do we believe that it will still work despite the pandemic? Uh, because um, even if um, cafe are probably um, also limiting um, dining in its place, um, it is still alive by the existence of third party delivery such as GoFood and GrabFood. So we believe that um, um, coffee shops are still um, are still uh, still have a high activity, and thus um, by supplying coffee, it will be beneficial for NH. And um, why do we choose um, cafes in Banyumas? Um, because um, it is basically closer to um, NH and Nurul Huda boarding school itself in um, Langgong Sari, and the close distance. Um, will offer a value proposition of NH coffee being cheaper than other coffee ingredients. So um, from that condition and also the value proposition that we can give as NH, um, we believe that it can um, add revenue stream and also tap a new market. To add Jingles answer, uh, how we would do that, we would probably take a door-to-door -door offer on how we are going to reach, you know, the cafes that are available. We are going to say that this is the value proposition that we can offer you. We are, we are going to give you cheaper and, and maybe, you know, more effective supply chain as we are located in the same city, for example. And we are going to yeah, do negotiation with those cafes that are interested. Yeah. I see. Okay. So uh, in terms of uh, competition in coffee, especially for the coffee beans and coffee powder in those area, is it something that uh, also and um, and can cope with? I mean, uh, do they have the ability to to compete? And how how do you do that? Um, okay, so um, com competition with coffee beans. Um, is my voice clear enough? Yes. Um, so um, we also um, consider that um, cafes may prefer other ingredients, um, which may be more fancier names or whatever, but we have value propositions. The first is that it is cheaper because it comes from the same city and it is locally sourced, which also contributes to its cheap and low price. And the third is that NHA has an, a distinct and altruistic um, value proposition as a product that self-sustain an Islamic boarding school. So if we offer those true values, um, we believe that um, we can win over um, some cafes in terms of um, yeah competition with other coffee beans. Okay, good, good. All right, thank you. Thank you, thank you everyone. Thank you very much. Thank you.